has anybody seen these devices before? These devices allow a third party voltage to be provided through your Cat5, Cat6 from one adapter to another adapter. In this case here, what we can use with these devices is that I can use, still use my PoE to power my TIO camera, but of course if there was anything else like in the cable management box, I can actually use these devices to provide another set of voltage. Now, I bought these five, six years ago, possibly even longer. So, of course, I'll show you in a second in better detail. Clearly, they're on the big side. So, of course, putting them in a cable management box could be somewhat um, problematic. However, these devices I bought five days ago. And, of course, they are absolutely tiny. Okay, now what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put my relay, my fly lead, my adapter into the cable management box. But first of all, what we need to do is we need to cover the actual relay to make sure that it doesn't touch the sides. You know, we don't want any um, problems with the device. So I've just made this pouch here and that should stop any of the spiky parts protruding through and touching this. Now, it's best in this circumstance that we start with a relay. So of course, I'm just gonna put that in there, okay? Then we'd have to use the adapter next. Okay, into place. DC jack done. RJ45 done. And then of course, we kind of like want to like roll it into position as such. I'm not going to do all of the screws, I don't want to bore everybody, but let's just... Okay, right, yes, looking good. Right, okay then. Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to move on to my other stand here, where I'm going to use two TIOC cameras. I'm going to need to upgrade the actual firmware to something very specific, but when I do that, I think that you will find the next step to be quite powerful. Okay then, so I believe I'm all set up here now. So I have the firmware uploaded into the TOX. We have two types of firmware. We have the red and blue light. We also have the white light. So let's just give them a test. Now for the red and blue, that is configurable from five to 30 seconds. And the white light is configurable from five seconds to 10 minutes. Okay, let's just give this a go. So, Alexa, intruder. Ooh. Okay, nicely done. Alexa, driveway on. Excellent. So uh, as we can see, we can now in fact actually control our red and blue lights and we can control our white light lights. Okay, that's it for me. So Alexa, turn everything off. Alexa, turn all lights off. 